Hi, this is Jorge from Team JBS, just doing a quick review on Snake Eyes, a G.I. Joe uh, origin story. Um, the quick synopsis of this movie is an ancient Japanese clan um, welcomed a tenacious loner Snake Eyes after he saves the lives of their heir. Upon arriving in Japan, uh, they teach him his ways of the ninja warrior while also providing him something he's been longing for, a home. However, when secrets from Snake Eyes Pass are revealed, his honor and allegiance get tested, even if it means losing the trust of those close to him. So overall, let me just start by saying this movie was just all out fun. Um, the amount of action and the way that they moved throughout the plot of this whole movie was phenomenal. Um, I definitely think that, you know, uh, Seeing how Snake Eyes kind of becomes Snake Eyes uh, was so well done. Um, I definitely think that they will be building upon this franchise a lot more. And I hope they continue it, um, especially if it's anything like this movie was. Uh, from start to finish, you're just going to have tons of action. Um, the fight scenes were actually choreographed ridiculously good. Um, I was very impressed, especially with all the, the sword fighting and all that. Um, some of the stuff, obviously, you know, one verse like 20, a little impossible, but definitely amazing. Um, I will say uh, Henry definitely fit the Snake Eyes. He played that so well. Um, a lot of people may know, you know, kind of the main character from Crazy Rich Asians or other of those movies, but he he actually has kind of become a bona fide action star, um, I would say, with this movie, um, which is quite a turn from his his normal type flicks that he does. Um, but definitely an, enjoyed it, enjoyed everything he was doing. Um, I will say, uh, I'm trying to think if I can think of even anything negative so far about this movie, and really it, not, not too much pops to mind. Um, based on a lot of the more recent uh, action movies that have come out here lately, this by far has topped my list, um, especially for summer blockbusters. Uh, this one has definitely been, right now it's my number one for sure. Um, I will say you, will, you won't be disappointed with um, all the callbacks to the, I guess, like original G.I. Joes. Um, it's very neat seeing how they toss those in there. Uh, you know, this is this is one of those few movies that oddly because the other G.I. Joe movies weren't that memorable but it makes me want to go watch them over again um definitely um you know something that I may do not sure if I'll do it or not but I may but overall you know I would say if you know rating this movie um in terms of action and all that you guys will not be disappointed this is a solid solid flick the plot and you know kind of the storytelling of this whole movie I thought was great. I thought some of the some of the callbacks and also some of the the misdirections that it took you in was pretty phenomenal. Um, you know, so I, I would say, you know, overall this movie, a solid 7.5 out of 10. Um, you know, definitely I know I saw this with um with another person when we screened it and I, I think they can kind of sum it up best with, you know this was a better Black Widow movie than Black Widow was, um, which is strange to say, but in terms of, you know, espionage and kind of sneaking around, killing and all that, like, this one checks all those boxes off. Um, definitely, you know, if you are a fan of uh, Japan, this movie will check off a lot of boxes as well, because most of it was set in Japan. So, you see that beautiful architecture, some of the city, um, nightlife and all that kind of blends in there. So overall, you know, I would say go check it out. I believe this comes out this Friday. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, put a comment uh, down below. Are you excited to see this? Um, if you did see it, what are your thoughts on it? Um, would love to interact with you guys a little bit more and would like to hear uh, more about what you think about Snake Eyes. But other than that, this is Jorge from Team JBS, and I'll see you next time. Peace.